Railroad track crossing is the most important steering system in the railroad. Railroad track consists of two parallel steel rails, set a fixed distance. The standard gauge is 4 feet 8.5 inches. Let's see how it works. In this system, wheel and rail, which play an important role in the track change process. The inner rim of the wheel, called a flange, is comparatively greater in diameter than the outer part which prevents the wheel from sliding off the track. Switch rails, or point blades, are the movable rails, which guide the wheels, towards either the straight or the diverging track. Stock rails are the running rails, immediately alongside of the switch rails, against which the switch rails lay, when in the closed position. Points operating rods. Points operating machine, also known as a point switch machine, or switch motor, is a device for operating railway turnouts, especially at a distance. Crossing. Crossing is a pair of switches that connects two parallel rail tracks, allowing a train on one track to cross over to the other. Check rails also known as guard rail, laid parallel to a running track to guide the wheels. All these rails are non-movable. Crossing nose. Crossing nose is a device, introduced at the point where two gauge faces cross each other, to permit the flanges of a railway vehicle to pass from one track to another. 